What's good, everybody? Welcome in. If you're watching this on the replay, make sure to say replay down in the chat. We're going to go over our $1,000, I think is what we spent, $1,000 thrift store haul extravaganza on this live. Um, make sure you like the live on Facebook or YouTube, whatever you're watching it on. Um, but this should be a lot of fun. We're going to show everything that we picked up. And uh, yeah, we'll go over prices, all that good stuff. So good, uh, good opportunity for those just coming into reselling. A lot of people on Facebook are just coming in. This is a great opportunity to see what we pick up to resell. Raphael, what's up? Um, Trish is in the house. What's up, Elliot? We're a little bit late because we were watching Line Creek's show. So we had to wait until Line Creek finished. Um, crazy show. Um, shout out to Roots Payable, Casey and Steve, right? Mm -hmm. Casey and Steve went and blessed Line Creek tonight like they did us. Bought out all of his merch, um, his merch today, all the proceeds went to the, um, what do you call it? The, the, he did the animal shelter. An, animal shelter. I was, I was thinking the pound. I didn't want to say the pound. I felt like that was bad, but, um, yeah, they, they bought out his entire whatnot, um, merch store and he gave them all away. So we were just waiting on his giveaways and then we hopped on. Normally he finishes around eight 30, but because he had to load in all those extras, he was, uh, he was taking a little bit longer, but awesome. Awesome. Roots Payable. Shout out Casey and Steve. They're awesome people. And uh, if you guys are watching this, Casey and Steve, yes, just let us know uh, what sizes merch shirts you need. Just DM me. I couldn't say that on whatnot because I can't talk about DMing me on another platform, but we got your number too. So we just text you too. Shout out to Roots Payable. Exactly. Appreciate everybody hopping on in. We got lots of stuff. Thousand dollars, thousand dollar thrift store haul. The reason we spent so much this week is because we didn't go to the store last week. And you guys know we get a ton from this store and uh, we didn't go last week. So the, the store was packed full of good stuff. Some of the stuff sat for a whole week and nobody picked it up. So really, really good stuff. You guys ready? What's up, Kirby? Kirby's over on YouTube. Appreciate you hopping on in. If you guys are watching us on TikTok and you have to leave, you can always rewatch this on YouTube or Facebook. This live gets published and you can rewatch it. So you seem to have the same sweaters in the back. Why? Because those are, I collect Kuji sweaters. If you watch this on YouTube or Facebook, you can actually see more. You can see more of the mess behind me too. But yeah, I collect those sweaters. So let's go. All right, let's go ahead and get started. I guess we'll just grab a random grab bag. A bag. Grab a bag. Let's go. A lot of this stuff, on average, how many items do you sell per week? Last month, we sold 600, I think it's 628 items. So do 628 divided by 30. That's how many items we sell on average per day. Just know that we do sell on whatnot. So that kind of boosts our numbers a little bit now. I think before whatnot, let me look at my numbers before whatnot. This will be able to tell kind of without whatnot what our average was. Um, so we were averaging about 400 items per month before whatnot. So a little over 10 items a day. Um, average unit sold was anywhere between 10 and 15. So yeah, like 12 units per day is what we were selling. Now we're selling 20 units per day, but that's because we're selling on whatnot. By the way, whatnot show, if you guys didn't know, look at this. I got a cool little ticker over on over on the other sites. We uh, we didn't announce this earlier because we wanted to make sure the merch shirts got here before we set it. He, he just missed the money gun. I did. I missed. The, did you miss the money gun I too? I kind of zoned out for like five seconds. Right mm, there, I missed so. the money gun. Whoever sent me the money gun, thank you. Who was that? <clears throat> Raphael. Raphael with another oh, money another gun. Another one. Holy cow. Raphael, stop it. You're crazy. But um, birthday whatnot show. My birthday is actually on Sunday. So we're going to have a birthday whatnot show. And we are going to be giving away a pair of 350 Yeezy Boosts. Uh, brand new in the box. These were supposed to be my pair. Actually, I have two of the same colorway. So I'm going to give one away. Um, we're going to run 100 items. This is going to be the buyer appreciation giveaway. We all also are going to have merch shirts available too. We got word that the merch shirts will be here, but these are the Yeezys we're going to be giving away. Brand new in the box. Got these from Adidas, straight from Adidas. These have been sitting in my closet, but these are the buyer appreciation giveaway. Probably the cleanest pair of solid black Yeezys. I like those. These are very nice, very nice, but these are the buyer appreciation giveaway. So if you buy one item, you're entered. If you buy a shirt, if you buy an auction item, Anything you buy gets you entered for the Yeezys. Beautiful shoe. I'm keeping the other one. The other one will never be up on auction because I have to have these. I wanted two on it. I wanted one, one on ice at all times, but I figured it's a good chance to give away. These are size 10 and a half. Really good size. Size 10 and a half um, Yeezy boosts. Those are going to be available this weekend, Saturday, 8.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We're running 100 items. What in the world? That was, a, that was a cake. 
appreciate it's you. A birthday cake. Oh, it was a birthday cake. That's right. Yeah, it was a birthday cake. <laughs> I keep for, I told her earlier today, I forgot it was my birthday this weekend. And I'm like, when it lined up that I knew the merch shirts will be in, I'm like, this is perfect. Like merch shirts, birthday, whatnot show, giving away a pair of Yeezys. We might have some more surprises. We're probably going to give away a bunch of merch shirts. So be there. Go bookmark the show. It's up right now. You can go to whatnot. You can bookmark the show. I want to see like 200 bookmarks by Saturday, right before we run the auction. I think we can get to 200 bookmarks and that would be pretty crazy. Um, so I'd appreciate you guys come out to support. You don't have to buy anything. There's going to be giveaways. There's going to be all kinds of craziness. Um, but I appreciate it if you would just come and hang out for the show. So, oh yeah, that's right. Yeah. I forgot. I forgot my birthday. It's a third. I've been asking him all week. What are we like? Do you want me to make you dinner? Do you want to go out? And he's like, Sunday, Sunday, right? Like, yeah. yeah, Sunday, your birthday. Like, what are we doing? So right if you want to make my birthday miserable, what you should do is buy a bunch of merch shirts. So I have to sit here on Sunday and ship all day. So happy early birthday. Minus day. Happy birthday, happy Jessica. Birthday, Let's Jessica. go. Uh, July birthdays are the best birthdays because we're farthest away from all special holidays. We get all the birthday gifts. So appreciate you guys. We come out. Go bookmark the show. It's available right now to go bookmark. If you bookmark, you'll get a notification again. You don't have to buy anything. Just come and hang out for the birthday show. That'll be really awesome and i would appreciate it let's go ahead and get started yours is 17th that's awesome mine's 16th yours is 17th you got a monday birthday monday yeah hopefully you're taking off work you don't have to go to work for monday um let me spin this camera really quick all right let's go ahead and get started first item is going to be this marmot shirt we paid a whopping five dollars for this this must have been on the rack since last week it's a really nice orange like lightweight um polyester shirt super nice shirt um, this will be up on whatnot. We're going to throw that up for one doll hair. Most of the stuff you're going to see is actually for whatnot. We've been sourcing for whatnot all week to get enough items for the whatnot show. Some of the stuff you might see on the next week's whatnot show, though. Leo's rock. We're, I'm a cancer. I'm a cancer. Next up we have for $15. Oh, let me go back to chat over here so I don't miss anybody. Happy birthday. Appreciate you, Sally. Next, um, we have a Polo Ralph Lauren size medium. We paid 15 bucks for it, but it is brand new with tags. So that's why we paid up a little bit for it. If you guys don't know, at TJ Maxx, these are th these things are 50 bucks now. $50 for Polo Ralph Lauren shirts is pretty crazy in my mind. But that's the cheapest you can find them, really. That's uh, whatnot. Most of this other Polo Ralph Lauren isn't going to be whatnot, though. This will be e-boy. This will be, e be for eBay. Cancer gang. Cancer gang. Uh, what's your whatnot name? Um, it's K-Way Shop. If you go through the link in the description of this video or the link in my bio... Um, if you haven't signed up yet, you can sign up and you get $15 credit. So go sign up if you haven't already. Next up, Polo Ralph Lauren. We bought a bunch of these today. They were four bucks each. I'm doing surf up method on these. This one looks like it stains in it though. Look at that. Oh, I see like right. Yeah. Boop, boop, boop. We'll, we'll wash this one and see if the stains come out. Unfortunately, thrift store lighting is horrible and you can never see the stains. So that will, uh, that will hopefully come out. Oh. Signed up today. Awesome. Two wash pile. That's eBay, yeah, two wash pile. Right there. Um, what is Whatnot? So Whatnot is a live selling app. It's just like this. We're literally just selling live. We put everything up for a dollar, 30 seconds sudden death, which means the timer doesn't go up. And if you buy one item, you're entered in for the Yeezy giveaway. I'll show those again at the end of the live. But you're entered for a pair of 350 Yeezy Boost in a size 10 and a half, brand new in the box. If you buy one item, including merch shirts, any merch gets you um, into the giveaway too. The one thing I'll say though is if you live over the border, if you live in Canada, you can't be entered in those giveaways. So Colts t-shirt is currently at 2050. If you guys didn't see Scott Way's um, TikTok, if you're on Facebook or YouTube, go to Scott Way 23. Um, he's doing a auction for a Colts t-shirt. Um, whatever he makes in the Colts t-shirt, um, auction wise, he's going to give that away to charity in honor of my mom, in honor of me, Kayla and Kat. So um, really cool. Really cool of you to do that, Scott Way. But go watch his video. Scott. Scott's the, the best. best. And he's he's currently in a bunker right now, hopefully ho hoping he doesn't get hit by a tornado. You didn't hear what? about that. Yeah, he was uh, he was on Lion Creek's auction. He's like, the, the sirens are going off right now. He's like buying from Lion Creek's Scott, auction. Scott, well, give us a thumbs up every couple no, he minutes. Just, he just commented. I think he's good. <laughs> we need to know. Next up, we got a North Face Summit series. This probably won't be on whatnot, at least not for a while, because it's not the season for this, so we'll hold this. But I didn't realize how good of a jacket this was until... Ethan showed me. By the way, there's 73 people on Facebook and YouTube right now. It's pretty crazy. Um, we paid $12.50 for this one, but it's a Gore-Tex jacket. So $12.50 for a 3-in-1 North Face Gore-Tex. It's a 3-in-1 because it has the inside liner. It has the regular jacket, and then you can wear it both together. So that's a 3-in-1 jacket, Gore-Tex. Really good jacket for $12.50. That's 
insane. That's insane. Was the storms real bad, Scott? Yeah. Scott, are you okay? He says he's in the basement. He's in the basement? Okay, Scott. That's why I need a thumbs up every couple minutes, Scott. I think he's good. If he's in the basement, he can come out and everything will be gone, but at least he'll... Hopefully he brought the Colts shirt down there. With, no, I'm just kidding. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully you're good, Scott. Hopefully you're good. Next up, we got another Polo Ralph Lauren. I picked these up. I'm not going to show these off too much because these are just plain old Polo Ralph Lauren. This is $4, and I'm listed for $17.99 plus ship. Scott Way says he's good. Okay. okay. Jay Stick, what's up? Appreciate you guys hanging out. If you guys are on TikTok, make sure you tap that screen. If you're watching this on YouTube or Facebook, make sure you hit that like button. Like button, send the comments, ask the questions. We'll try to get a lot to a lot of people tonight. Next up, another one, $4, Polo Ralph Lauren. Again, list this for $17.99 plus ship. Jennifer wants to know if we ever do live on Poshmark. Do you ever do live on Poshmark? No, we haven't done one. We're not opposed to it, though. Uh, we might do a live on Poshmark eventually, but for right now, uh, Whatnot is where everybody currently is. So um, maybe in the future. I, I, I never say no now because I used to say I wasn't going to do Whatnot, and now I'm on Whatnot. So I, I can't. I have to tell myself I'm never going to – I can't say never. But never say never. Never say never, like Justin Bieber. <laughs> um, Twelve fifty is what we paid for this one. Half off. Um, Polo Ralph Lauren, brand new at tag size medium. Again, this will be on whatnot. Just joining. How was your shopping trip today? It was good. We spent a grand, and I know that sounds crazy, but we didn't go to the store last week, so we had so much stuff, um, and we were buying heavy for whatnot. So that's why that's why we spent a G. But I mean. Really good stuff. Like that North Face jacket alone, I'm assuming that North Face jacket is at least 100 bucks alone by itself. So really, really good stuff. Um, another North Face, this older label North Face, we paid $10 for it. But it's a nice fleece lined, like almost like a quilted, kind of looks quilted, but it's not North Face jacket. Um, it doesn't have the hit on the back, but it does have that hit on the front. $10, this will go into the winter pile. And you might see this either on my eBay store in the winter season, or it might end up on whatnot. Wayne never says no to me. Give her. Yeah, I'm a giver. I'm a giver. What other places do you shop other than thrift stores? We do retail stores too. I can't tell you which retail stores, but we do shop at retail stores. Size medium. This reminds me of a 420 shirt. This is like, this screams 420 all over it. Uh, really nice Ralph Lauren. We only paid $4 again for this one. This one I'll probably list a little bit higher than $17.99 plus ship. It'll probably be like right around $19.99 or maybe $22.99 plus ship. Why can't you tell? I can't tell you which th which retail stores I go to because with thrift stores, there's rotating inventory, right? If I told you what retail stores I buy from either in store or online, that could kill the market. You could literally, everybody would just go rush to those retail stores and pick up stuff. Even though the ones I used to source at are kind of drying up a little bit. Um, I can't really just give that away. So Rasta short shirt, Rasta. What size is the North Face? Um, North Face. I think it was a medium. Yeah, if you guys see anything. Medium. Yeah, it's a medium. If you guys see anything you like, make sure you DM me. If you're on um, Facebook, you can also message me on Facebook. I'll check that after the live. Um, but if you see anything, we'll give you a great deal on it. We'll give it to you under market because that's what we do. Uh, another $4 Ralph Lauren shirt. This one looks to be. Nope. See, it's got a spot on it. Yeah. You can never see these in store. These Ralph Lauren shirts are notorious, but we'll throw that in the wash. It'll come out in the wash. K-Way's one secret. Yeah, it's my only secret I have to keep. So when would you start selling winter clothing? So I used to list them all year round. Now that we found this store and we get so much stuff, um, we're going to start listing the winter stuff in September. But I'll say this, if you guys don't get all of this stuff that we get and you're like out of stuff to list and you still have winter stuff to list, just list the winter stuff. For example, I sold the North Face jacket today for 55 plus ships. So they will still sell in the, and it sold to somebody in Jacksonville. It'll still sell, but you want to make sure that you're listing the cold weather or the hot weather gear first before you listen to cold weather gear because it'll sell a little bit better. Another Ralph Lauren shirt, brand new with tags. This one we paid $12.54. That one's going to go on whatnot. Duval. My winter stuff um, sells are already picking up. Yeah, you'll see that in September-ish. You'll start seeing like, they'll start moving really, really fast. And last item for this bag is I learned this brand from Chris at Peak and his sensei, Jason Hayes. This is a straight down uh, windbreaker and it was only two bucks. Just a straight down windbreaker. Really nice. This might actually go on whatnot. Just throw it up for a dollar. See where it goes. Whatnot piece. What's the average turnaround on an item? So th this is going to be difficult for me to answer. It used to, I used to be able to give this answer and it used to be uh, we sell 50 around around 50% of our inventory every 90 days. 
that number has increased because obviously now we're selling whatnot stuff. So for example, that straight down jacket is going to sell this weekend on Saturday. So it's hard for me to give like numbers to people who don't sell on whatnot because we're moving stuff so fast now. Uh, we probably sell like 60 ish to 70 ish percent of our inventory every 90 days now. And that's only going to increase over time. So before I started doing whatnot is 50% every 90 days. So I'll just leave it at that. That's about what you should do if you're listing the stuff that we're buying on a site like eBay, Poshmark, or Mercari. But I don't want to give you guys the wrong idea and say I sell 70% of my inventory, but I'm also selling on whatnot. It's a little, it's a little tricky. It's a little tricky. Drop the receipt. That's the small receipt, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's yeah, the, that's the baby receipt. So what happened at the thrift store today is we had to, I had to call the bank because I didn't have enough cash and both of our cards only allow us to pull out um, 400 a day on each card. And we only had uh, $920 and this was over, this was right at a thousand. So I had to call the bank and say, Hey, can you extend my limit today? And they said, sure. So we had two different transactions. This is a pair of Piranha men's pants. These are a size 3232. We paid 650 for these. Just a really nice, stretch outdoor pant this will end up on whatnot for a dollar i'm interested and think um we're gonna give it a shot let's go that's awesome i have tons of content here to learn how to do it so definitely give me a follow tons of content there's also other people in the chat right now if you guys are on tiktok i know there's not a lot of people on facebook or youtube but if you're on tiktok and you make reselling content leave me a thumbs up in the chat everybody who's new here go follow everybody that's leaving a thumbs up in the chat uh, we can't use card at this thrift store because it's a cash only store what is whatnot? Link in my bio. Go sign up. Um, you get fifteen dollar credit. Whatnot is a live selling app, and that's what we're doing this weekend. I got my my birthday whatnot. Let's do this again. This is cool. I like this thing. We got my birthday whatnot this weekend. We're gonna have the brand new merch shirts running, um, all in the buy it now, and we're giving away a pair of three fifty Yeezys. I'll show those again at the end of the live. But um, yeah, come out eight thirty p.m. Eastern Standard Time this Saturday. Go bookmark the show if you haven't already. Go bookmark it right now. I think this is women's. Mm, yeah, it's a, you found that one. okay. Fine, I'll show it. Even though I found it, it's a women's piece. It's a free people size, small free people. We paid six fifty for it. Just a nice like knit free people sweater. I think this is going to winter pile, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's going to go winter pile. Winter what? Winter. Is pirate ship hard to figure out? No, you just log into pirate ship. You hook up your credit cards, um, and credit or debit or your PayPal, and then you put in your information. You put in your weight and dimensions. You buy your label. So. I'm not good at making videos. That's okay. Go look at my first videos. Kayla says she's not good at it, but I think she's pretty good at it. Um, go look at my first videos. They all suck. Uh, do we need to be ending each listing and sell similar after 30 days? I use a site called Auto Posture to do that for me. It is a good practice to do that if you don't want to pay for Auto Posture, but I use Auto Posture. It does it for me. It's automated. Automated. Next up, this is a men's piranha um, sweater. Size is it size medium? We only paid five bucks for this. Really good brand, um, decently selling, like a mid tier, like outdoor brand. Just a nice piranha full zip. That'll probably go on whatnot this weekend. Whatnot. We're gonna put a couple like winter pieces in there too. We're gonna start moving a little bit more winter pieces in there because even though it's the middle of summer, winter was, was literally right around the corner. Kayla is the goat at videos. Yeah, no, she's, no. she's good they, at videos. They are. They're okay. They're fine. Five dollars. This is a brand new with tag. Um, Ralph Lauren. It does have a hit at the bottom. I didn't see that. That is actually a decent hit too, right there. This is the, Ooh, oh no, it's anchor. not. I thought, it, I thought it was the, uh, you guys know the Ralph Lauren that has the, the boot and the wings. It's like the shoe with the wings. I forgot what they call that exactly, but this one will end up on whatnot. Um, starting at a dollar this weekend. I forgot what that's called. It's like a run. It's like run something. Somebody in the chat's got to know. Somebody in the chat. P wing. That That's what it is. P wing. Anytime you find that, those go for good money. Also, the polo bear ones go for good money. That's actually really good blended. You know your stuff. Blended, you used to work for Ralph Lauren, didn't you? You notice how I'm saying Ralph Lauren now? I'm not saying Ralph Lauren. I got made fun of so much, so I stopped doing that. Next up, um, $7.50. Yeah, P-Wing is a Super Mario 3 thing, yeah. Um, this is a nice North Face. Really nice. It's got the spell out but the there's like a patch see that patch and it's like a raised patch it's pretty cool size small men's i wish it was a bigger size but size matters then in this case it doesn't really nice um hoodie so that'll be up on whatnot this weekend i found ralph lauren purple label today let's go we did not find very many just kidding there there's one many what 
yellow tags. Oh yeah. <laughs> then you pull out a yellow tag. Yellow tag. So this was full price. This is a foot joy quarter zip, really good condition on this one. I don't think there's any golf club embroidery, which is great. Uh, kind of hurts the value a little bit if you have some crappy golf club and it's a size large. We did pay eight bucks for it, but that's okay. This will probably be on either this week's whatnot show or next week's whatnot show. It's all the eBay listing in the last 90 days. Yeah. That's a nice poll. It is. Um, is there any certain time of day that you would find better items? I've seen Goodwill employees. So we go to our stores like first thing in the morning, um, especially the red, white, and blue store that we go to because they're stocking all throughout the morning. I think the employees get there like an hour early and they're stocking the shelves. And then that's the day. Wednesday is the day that they change tags over. So the tag that wasn't half off the week before is now half off. So if you get there first thing in the morning, you can get some of the tags that were there last week that are now marked down. So that's why we go first thing in the morning for, to those stores. We also go first thing in the morning to Goodwills too, because they also stock around here. You just got to figure out your thrift stores. I know some, some don't let employees stock early and they stock in the middle of the day. So you just got to go there in the middle of the day. It just depends on your area. Next up, this is going to look like a crazy pickup, but this is a Boy Scouts of America shirt. We paid full price $4 for this. Um, but these go for like 25 bucks. The more patches, the better. So this has patches all over it. This will go for right around 25 bucks and it should sell within a month. Yeah, red, white, and blue is, your red, white, and blue is crazy on Wednesdays. See, ours isn't too bad. Today was actually pretty packed in the morning, but then it always settles down. So, yeah. All right, this was a really cool find. Um, I get a lot of questions do you buy kids stuff? We don't normally buy kids stuff, but it has to be good kids stuff for us to pick it up. So we paid six fifty, but this is a kids boys reversible North face um, jacket. Really nice. So the inside is gray, gray inside, just solid gray reversible. And then the outside has that camo. And then if you ever find these and you can't find the size tag, it's in one of the pockets. So there's the size tag right there. So it tells me this is a boys size large. So this is definitely an easy pickup for six fifty. Um, this will probably sell actually on the high end for like around forty bucks because of that camo pattern. So I found that just sitting at the end of a rack, just literally sitting there. And I found it like an hour and a half into the live thrift, which is pretty crazy. There's probably been tons of people that walk by that. So um, is that a seam or tear in the upper right? Let me see. Is there a seam or tear in the upper right? Hopefully not. If not, we can get it fixed. Uh, no, looks good. I don't see no tear. Oh, you might've been thinking about this, that thing right there. That's just a, that's just a, get one of those, one of those stray, stray little furry things. All right. This will be on whatnot. This is a, this is a bigger size. So I'm going to try to run a couple bigger sizes this weekend. Um, two XL Jordan hoodie. Uh, we only paid four bucks for it. But it has this, I don't know what that logo is. I've never seen that before. It's got the elephant print for like the Jordan 3s, but I've never seen that specific logo. But it's a hoodie. Hoodie, full zip. If anybody knows what that is, I'm going to do Google image search. I'm actually going to do it right now and try to figure out what that is. But that's something. It's, it's some kind of collab or something. But yeah, I'll figure out what that is and when I'll be able to talk about it on whatnot, but that'll be up on whatnot for a dollar. Size 2XL. Let's get some women's items. I'm tired of talking. Here. There's some women's in there. Yeah, but you from us. That's okay. You you can take This her. is men's. No, this is women's. This is all men's stuff. That's one well, jacket. They want to see your face for two minutes. Hi, guys. I've been talking too much. Did you get two of the same jackets? Almost. Pretty close. You right, guys I didn't Kayla, find right? these, but... We don't have an LLC. What did you find? A North Face Teddy sweater. What did you pay? Let's see. Six fifty. What's up? Check my text. From who? Ethan. Okay. He's checking now. This is nice. This is very nice. Size. So um it doesn't have a size tag. No, the size tag was ripped out. It's only bad for about Okay, hold on, because there's another one that looks just like it, and if they match, here's another North Face. This is an extra large, and we paid seven. No, we paid fifteen. Yellow is not half off. Another Teddy sweater. Jordan is. 
So let's see. Oh. Can you hold this up and see if these are the same size? Since, um, yeah. Did you find these both next to each other? This one's an extra large. Oh. Trisha wants to know. Whoa, my phone's blowing up. Um, hold on. They're probably the same. Eh, maybe it's a little bit smaller. This so looks like maybe a little a medium? bit smaller. Yeah, that looks. This so one. So the looks darker like, green looks like a medium. This full jacket looks like a medium. The full fluffy looks like a medium. The Denali jacket is a size XL. So women's XL. Those will both be on whatnot. Let's see. This might be a fun way to do hauls. You each show the other's items. Fun fact. I'm very familiar with the men's items because I drafted them for so long. So mm -hmm. I can do the men's stuff. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. When it comes he doesn't to know any stuff. of the women's stuff. So I'm like, both those, both. both those North faces will be on whatnot for a dollar, by the way, this weekend. So that's it for the women's in this bag. <laughs> I have some good stuff, but this is not um, my bag for me. Do you do scrubs? If so, what, what brands? I always, always, always check the scrub section, no matter which thrift store I go to. You're looking for figs and Janu. Um, I'm testing Koi. It's sold for us so far, but don't go out and buy all the Koi. I'm just testing it. And then I did pick up two Disney scrubs. They haven't sold yet, but those are also a test just to see. How Real they quick, let me sneak in here. Mayor Bear just messaged me on um, Instagram. Um, the reason you're getting charged $2 per listing is because you're using the bold, I believe. If you put your title in and you click the bold button, I think it's bold or it's like subtitle button or something like that, they'll charge you $2 on your listing. You must have accidentally pressed that button when you listed that item. So that's why you're getting charged that. You can actually take that off at the setting at the top right so you never have to see that again. But that's probably why you're getting that $2 charge. There we go. Oh. I had to answer that real quick. That way, get it. Okay. I'm sitting on Grey's Anatomy scrubs. No, I do not pick up Grey's Anatomy, but that is one of my favorite shows. So, you know. All right, this is men's, so okay. I'll be back. You want, you want to find some women's, one of your women's bags over there? Yeah. <clears throat> the people don't like seeing my face the whole time. They want to see Kayla. We want to see Kayla. We want to see Kayla. Um, by the way, Ethan's going to be here this weekend for our WhatNot show. He's going to be helping us run the show so we can both be on camera at the same time. So appreciate you, Ethan. Everybody say thank you, Ethan, in the chat. Do you thrift from Goodwill for all of these? No, these are all from Red, White, and Blue. So, Tim, if you go watch some of our live thrifts that are up on YouTube right now, appreciate the uh, heart me. You can, go, you can go watch all of our live thrifts on uh, YouTube, and those are all from a place called Red, White, and Blue. Um, when did you start uh, listing winter clothing? I think I got that. Um, September is when we're going to start listing that. Um, when you say on um, whatnot for a dollar, is that starting point of each auction? Yeah, it's starting point of each auction. So they all start at a dollar. We load them in at a dollar. Um, people might pre-bid them, though. Yeah, thank you, Ethan. Ethan's the best. Ethan's going to be here. Unfortunately, Ethan doesn't drink, so we'll have him a nice glass of water set up in the corner. We might even put a little lemon in there for him because your boy Ethan doesn't drink. He's a very, very honest young man. I, I, I brought him up very well. <laughs> Next up, we have a J. Crew Ludlow jacket. Really good jacket to be on the lookout for. J. Crew Ludlow. Um, I don't know exactly what this thing is going to sell for because I'm still learning my J. Crews. But I would assume that this is at least a $50 bill, and we paid $650 for it. Um, always look out for J. Crew jackets. They sell very, very well, very fast. So I don't price these too high, though. I price them according, accordingly to get them to sell. That's going to be an eBay item. Oh, my days. Spice it up, add some lemon. Yeah, maybe a little lime in there, too. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll throw a lime in there and confuse them. It's just sparkling water. Ooh, sparkling really? water. Yeah. Oh, that's like drinking soda, <laughs> though. I don't know. Ethan, do you drink sparkling water? <laughs> Um, J crew, we paid seven fifty for this J crew. Um, I don't pick up all J crew. Like I picked up that one right there. And this is one I pick up right here. Look at that. Um, all over camo print pattern. Really nice. Really, really nice pattern size, small men's. Um, even though it's a smaller size, I still pick it up because this will sell. It's a really nice, like military looking jacket. I was surprised that one was still there too. The only time we, no. um, no, that's going to go eBay. Um, the only time we wash items, Amanda, is if um, the item has stains or bad smells. Actually, what do you think? Do you guys think we should throw that J. Crew up on whatnot, or should are you guys interested in it, or no? If you guys are interested in it, we'll throw it up on whatnot for a dollar this weekend. I'm not really sure how you guys feel about um, Jordan stuff. Um, Air Jordan on the hoodie you picked up earlier. What about it, Jemmy? What did Jemmy say? Jemmy, I missed your first comment. What about the Air Jordan on the hoodie? You got more info on it? Hi, Wayne and Kayla. What's up? <laughs> Someone said. Um, 
KB said, add a cute little drink umbrella. <laughs> add a little, cute little drink umbrella. Um, Sally says, do you, sab do you sabotage yourself by telling what you paid and hoping people will pay more than that? No. So if you go watch our whatnot shows, pretty much everything sells for just around market price, sometimes over market, market price, sometimes under market price, but it's right around market price. So we don't sabotage ourselves. Everybody in the chat is here to support us and they know that we're putting up good items and a lot of people are buying them from, this, from themselves. So it doesn't really affect us by telling telling what we paid. We don't mind telling what we paid. Like we paid $20 for these Bluff Work pants. Um, I looked up comps. I recently bought a, bought a pair of jeans in Bluff Works. I haven't sold them yet because I haven't listed them yet, but I think they should go for right around 50 bucks and they should sell pretty quick. So Line Creek is in the house. Line Creek, that was an amazing show. That's going to go eBay. That was an amazing show, Line Creek. That was that was awesome. You guys didn't miss Line Creek show. He did that. That was very cool show. Really, really good show. Really good show. I liked it. You guys should all follow Line Creek on whatnot too. I think the tag fell off on these. We only paid five bucks for these. The tag was right there. Um, these are Polo Ralph Lauren corduroy pants in a size 36 or 38. I can't remember. But we'll list these winter season. We're not going to list these right now. These will be definitely winter sellers. Nice heavy corduroy pants. Um, if you're not picking these up in Brooks Brothers, Ralph Lauren, brands like that, they sell really well wintertime. Um, how do you compete with lower price listings of the same item? Good title, good description, good photos, good reviews. Everything good. Good, 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 and good. That's how you compete with other people. Next up, we paid full price for this, $13. But this is a Brooks Brothers. Brooks Brothers suit. Um, there's no, it's not like a special edition one. I don't think no, but it is a wool. Hang on. It's like a wool cash. I think it's cashmere. No, it's silk linen and wool. So it's really good combo of materials, a really nice color to this suit. Um, I didn't look up comps, but paying 13 bucks for it. I think at least 50 is what I should expect. 50 bucks period. Good, good, good. And good. It's flax by Jenny. A good pickup. Flax anything is pretty much a good pickup. Yeah, flax anything is pretty much a good pickup. You're probably you're probably looking at, at least like forty to fifty bucks on that one. I'm just guessing. I'm I'm assuming, but most flax will go for anywhere between forty and fifty, especially men's flax. Another thirteen dollar um, suit jacket. This is a J Crew Ludlow jacket. I don't know if you can see that. It says J Crew Ludlow jacket. It's a corduroy one. Corduroy all throughout. Really, really nice jacket. Again, J. Crew jackets do really good for us. So we're going to list this one probably like, again, like right around 50 plus ship. 150 bucks. <clears throat> All right. Last item out of this bag, and then we'll get Kayla on the camera so you can stop hearing me talk the whole time. Um, this is a men's barber jacket. Barber quilted interior. Uh, we paid $12.50 for it. This will definitely be a winter listing item it's got the corduroy collar really nice corduroy collar and then quilted all throughout it's a lightweight quilted jacket so winter season this is like at least 50 bucks i wish you had bigger women's clothes i like the brands you pick up we try to find as we try to find bigger bigger women's items they're just harder to find um and thrift stores those are like the first ones to go is the the bigger sizes we're, we're kind of passing on smaller sizes now like Spanx and stuff, we used to pick up an extra smalls. We're kind of moving away from that because mm -hmm. they sit too long. So we're trying. We're trying to find your 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 stuff. So we're working on ways to get that stuff too. Sizes. Is there a sweet spot for pricing? Um, yeah, you just look up sold comps on eBay, and that's how you get the sweet spot. So, what size on the barber? Go ahead, you can start. Hello. Okay, so pretty much most of the women's stuff. I picked up four whatnot because we were doing a big whatnot show. I do try to get sizes for everybody extra small all the way up. I try so everybody can have something. So let's see what the size we got. tag is on the, the barber jacket, actually. It's not in the pockets? No, I don't see a size Hey, Polly. Tag. Okay. If you're interested in the, the barber jacket, just hit me up on Instagram. I'll have to send you measurements because I don't see a size tag anywhere on this thing, not even in the pocket. So hit me up on IG. Okay, for six fifty, I picked up this new tag Madewell size fourteen. This is a really cute, like I want to say shawl, but I'm pretty sure that's wrong. But you put this over your shirt, and it does have a cute, like you can tie it, and it has ruffles. So this is for whatnot. Boop. You're so pretty. 
What's your beauty routine? Nikki, stop. This is about to go to bed routine. <laughs> Haven't taken makeup stain off. Stained shirt routine. Hot mess. Stain yeah, stained shirt for my <laughs> child. Like, I'm a hot mess. I'm lucky if I even remember to wash my face. <laughs> is that a wrap shirt? It does have the tie in the front. So possibly, but you definitely want to wear a shirt under that. Okay. This one is full price as soon as I can show it to you. Um, the North Face Medium, 15 bucks. This is a really cute, really nice full zip jacket. This will be for winter. Okay, then I have... What did we find? So for $5... We have this extra large Harley Davidson, but look how pretty like the laces on the sleeve and look at how shimmery the, the uh, wings are. I'm sorry. The camera being flipped really throws me off. <laughs> that is for what not. And then I found this super cute, super cute top. I don't think you've seen these because I just put these in the cart without no, I didn't see any of this. showing you. This is a free people size small. It's like the older free people tag. I believe it was 650. Look how pretty the ruffles are. I love the colors. I love the blue and the purple. This is for whatnot. Like I said, most of this stuff is whatnot. Heads up. Figs released business casual pants. Ooh. Ooh nice. All right. Everybody shopping pants. Look for figs. You know, I noticed when... Um, I find a lot of figs bottoms in the pants section because they almost... They're like regular joggers, almost. So, don't be surprised. Enter Emma really quick. I think you can handle that one. Where's Emma? Emma up top, right there. Emma, where are you? Is it right here? Yep. Okay, do y'all get people asking you to email them pictures on Poshmark, saying that Poshmark isn't showing them well? Don't do that. That's yep. a scam, right? That's a scam. Kimono, so, that's what it is. Yeah, they're, they're, okay. try, they're trying to um, get your email. They're trying to hack your account. They're trying to contact you outside of Poshmark to get you to send them random payments. You don't want to do that. If you ever get questions on eBay or Poshmark to get contacted outside the platforms, mm -hmm. don't do that because it's always a scam. Every single time. It'll never not be a scam. Do everything through the platform. Yep. This is for Sinless. She specifically requested it. It was two bucks. She wanted this bell shirt. Nice. She was watching the live when I happened to go buy it. What do we pay for that? Two? Two. And she's always so getting stuff sin for us, sinless, so. sinless. I don't know if she's on here or not. Sinless always buys from us, so yeah. Sinless is getting this for two fifty plus shipping. That's what she's going to pay for this. We're literally going to give it to her for what we paid yeah, for it because she, she's, she's awesome. always buying stuff from us. So you get it for what we paid for it. Going straight to you. Do, do, do. I found a pair of Figs sweatpants today. Didn't know they made them. Ooh, sweatpants. Figs sweatpants. I didn't know about Figs sweatpants. Now I will keep an eye out. I think this is a you fun, but... You can show it. I'll show it. This is an Athleta. It is an older tag Athleta. It is a size medium, but it's a nice jacket. Nice full zip blue jacket. It's a heavier jacket, too. It's yeah, like a heavier it's got the hood. For the winter. This might, we could throw this on whatnot this week. I think this will go do okay. Yeah, you can put on whatnot, too. Yeah, it's good. Whichever works. Then I found this shindig. I got to fight it first. This is called, oh, I looked it up. It's like a satin. It's intimately free. It is a size large, intimately free satin cami because it ties here in the back. I can't show this very well. There we go. And then there's like the back. We paid $5, so I couldn't pass it up. I'm thinking whatnot. I haven't decided. Because it's like 2025, so I'm not sure. I'll we'll just start with the whatnot pile. We can decide later. I mean, yeah, I guess so. Okay. Uh, Amanda asked, do we look for shoes? We leave our sh the shoe section alone for our buddy, Ethan, um, who we made the video about. If you look on Facebook, you can see the last video. That's Ethan. Um, not the last video, but the video before that. So we leave the shoes alone because he's he does strictly shoes. Somebody's asking what whatnot is, too. Oh, Juliet. Hi, Juliet. Queen is here. Ask her for her autograph. She never, uh, she never gives me her autograph, so maybe she'll give you her autograph. <laughs> Juliet, I need your autograph. Did you just ask me about whatnot? Yeah. Some oh, Lauren, Lauren says, says, what's whatnot? Whatnot is a live auction site. So we're going to show you the item, talk about it. And all the while, you have 30 seconds to put in your auction. Everything starts at a dollar. And right at the bottom, it'll show you to slide for a dollar so you can bid on the item. 
And the last one that has their bid in before 30 seconds gets the item. But it's really fun because we're showing all the items. We're talking. If you um, sign up, we got a link in our bio of this or a description of this video. If you sign up through whatnot, through that link tree link, um, you'll get a $15 credit to spend for free. It's free money. It's literally $15 for free. No catches. You just got to sign up. <laughs> Athletic cardigan. Nice. Um, I was going to say chunky knit, but it's not chunky knit, but nice knit cardigan. It's an ombre, so it starts super dark. Goes up to the top. It says it's small, but I bet this could be a medium. It's very loose. I love picking up cardigans because you can wear them all year round. What do you want to do with this one? Um, what? No. I signed up for auto posture with your link. Let's Thanks, go. Maddie. Appreciate you. You're going to love it. Eileen Fisher. I love picking up Eileen Fisher. These are size 3X, nice black dress pants, and we paid $7.50. I couldn't leave it behind. It did have the tag on the inside. So these are for eBay. Mm -hmm. For you. For me. For you. Then we got some Athleta Smalls. I did pay $5, but I liked the bottom, like the pattern at the bottom. And these are for whatnot. And they also have the zip on the back, the back pocket. So those look like spider webs at the bottom. They do kind of look like spider webs. Interesting. Those are for whatnot. <laughs> Oh, I love this. I wish this was my size. Okay. This is North Face. It is an extra small, but it's one of those super soft, like, teddy sweaters where you can see how soft it is. This is nice. Are those the, fireworks? Yeah, those are fireworks. Hopefully the dog doesn't start barking. Oh, my gosh. Hopefully the baby doesn't wake up and try and crawl out of his crib again. That's what is our child not? has learned how to do. Is this, is this winter or whatnot? What do you want to do with this? Winter. Yeah. I did end up grabbing this. This is intimately free. It is a large. We paid $7.50. This is a bodysuit. When I looked up comps, they were um, like $20, $25. So I wanted to give it, it's a fuzzy. I wanted to give it a shot. I haven't sold an intimately free bodysuit before. Uh, this is eBay? Yes, eBay. <clears throat> is it 4th of July over yet? Yeah, I don't know. It must be the, might be the, actually no, it doesn't it sound like it. can't be the. Random. Baseball. It's Florida for you. Florida Phew. people. Florida, man. <laughs> Some more Eileen Fisher. These are a size medium. We paid $5. Some more just nice dress pants. These are for eBay. Love picking up Eileen Fisher. Also a bolo are noble leggings. Resell for over $40 a pair. Ooh. I have to keep an eye on I have not found noble leggings yet. This is a new to me brand. Well, I've seen this brand picked up plenty of times from other resellers. I just have not found it myself. So I want to give it a shot. House of Harlow. It was $4. Um, it's like half a sweater. I'm not really sure what it's called. It's like a, what do you call this half sweater thing going on? <laughs> what do we call this? <laughs> I was even on my live. I'm like, I'm not sure where the other half of the sweater went, but, um, it's cute, and I recognize the brand, so I want to give it a, a try. A shrug. Okay. This is a shrug. Yeah, I would wear that and just have my belly hanging out. <laughs> <laughs> have my hairy belly hanging out. Oh is wearing gosh. that thing. A Man, shrug. A crop one... sweater? I was like, I don't know, but I recognize the brand's eBay. Just imagine. That's like, eBay. I want to try it because I've never. Do that. Uh, and just have my belly. Scott says it's his size. Just have my belly hanging out, like right here. <laughs> That'd be beautiful. Oh, that's hilarious. Anyway, I'm going to give that a shot. All right. Here's I'm going to wear it first. Can you wear it Saturday? Yeah. Or what not show? What not live? <laughs> These are Athleta Wander Slim Ankle Pants. These are the new style when it tells you what it is. And these are also new at Tag. And we did pay $17.50. But these are nice pants. Some of these new at Tag Athletas can do really well. But I'm going to put these on whatnot for a dollar. Dollar. A dollar. Because I'm weird and crazy. Uh, Barry needs that shrug. <laughs> These are free people movement size large. Nice large joggers. I actually had some of these up on Whatnot last week. And now we have them in a size large. Because last week I had them in a small. And we paid five bucks. That is the logo you're looking for. For free people movement. These are for Whatnot. Bestie, hey Mac. Kayla, what do you go live on when you thrift? I'm on my phone. I go just use my phone on my TikTok account. 
we are going to probably make a YouTube channel for Kayla so she can put all of her live thrifts on YouTube because uh, everybody keeps requesting you to have your own YouTube channel. So oh. that way you can put your own reels up there and stuff too. So yeah, cool. hopefully soon. We'll make that maybe this weekend before we do our whatnot show. Oh, Add more things to our plate. <laughs> you know, I got to remember to post on there, but I will do it. I'm getting better. My videos are a little bit better as you can you watch them. All the ladies in the chat, they're always like, where's Kayla's live? I want to watch Kayla's live. And I'm like, man, I can only post so many lives to my channel. I don't want to be flooded with lives. So we'll have to <laughs> separate it out and give Kayla her own channel. I think she deserves it at this point. She's got a bigger following than me at this oh, point. Everybody's tapping please. the screen for her. Yeah. Even we do, we, won we today. do really well on the likes. Even though we did win today. You, you know? cheated I because cheat. my phone was dying. No, no, that. You, and then you decided listen, to hang out. If you're running a race and you break okay, your leg, let's halfway ask the through, chat. I don't. Who that, won? The chat's gonna side with you. Today's live thrift likes. Okay. Listen, if you're running a race and you break your leg, almost at the finish line, it's not my fault. You can't get the finish line. Okay. I got to the finish line today. You just kept on running past the finish line. That doesn't count. That's you okay. just kept on going. <laughs> Everybody who says Kayla is gonna get a bit. No, I'm just kidding. Wayne cheated. See, Ethan was there. Witness. Oh, Ethan. Witness. Ethan. Sorry, guys. Ethan, she, she, does, she doesn't even want to pay for your lunches. I'm the one who has to convince her to pay for your lunches, okay? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> He's salty right now. Do you guys hear him simmering right now? Because we I actually won. If I, hold, if I hold, hide my head right here, even YouTube and Facebook can't see me cry. <laughs> Some Lulus, size 6, good size. We did pay a little bit up. We paid 15 but these are nice Lulu pants. Solid blue. Those are nice. They even have the little like gold hits on the drawstrings mm -hmm. and it does have the lulu logo i know you guys can't see it not all the time will the aglet have the lulu logo but sometimes this is i find the lulus faster looking at the aglets than standing there looking for the logo those will be on whatnot i'm not getting paid for whatnot so team kayla see ethan's coming over here be helpful ethan i just said we'll get you some water buddy with an umbrella what size are these people are asking size six size six, size six. I six. I'm trying to pull out my stuff. Give me a second. Yes, these are more Lululemon. Give me a second to find the size, guys. Nice. I was going to say joggers. Yes, these are Lululemon joggers. I know there's a size on here. It's got the hit right down here, too. Give me a second. These are a size four, four Lululemon joggers. Those are nice. We paid 15 again, but they're joggers. So I'm going to go ahead and put these on whatnot for a dollar. Yep. How do we bid? Tommy, we're, we're going to run the whatnot auction this weekend. Um, you want to do the little, look at this. This is cool. Um, if you guys are watching this on TikTok, oh, you, do you, do you, you don't get the little things. You just click this and click this. So we have a whatnot show this weekend, 8.30 p.m. Eastern what? Standard Time. The little thing is running at the bottom. It's my birthday whatnot show. We're going to be running 100 items at a dollar. We're show. also going to have all the new merch shirts available too this weekend. So we have 100 merch shirts, 50 men's, 50 women's. Um, and we're also giving away a pair of Yeezys. I'll show those at the end of the live. So we're going to give away a pair of 350 Yeezy boosts in a size 10 and a half. I think resell on these are like 300 bucks. So we're giving away for buyer appreciation. So at this weekend on whatnot. Link in my bio, sign up. You get $15 um, credit. Guys. If you're watching my live, you know that I about near crap my pants in the aisle. When I found this brand, I've been looking for this brand. I have a list in my mind of all the brands I want to find, and I have not found them, but I did find one of them today. Spell. Oh, oh it's such a glare. Yeah, you, you can't see it. Oh, there the we go. Spell and the Gypsy. Great brand to be on the lookout for. These are new at tag. We did pay a full $35 for these. I was very hesitant, but um, sold comps were over 100 Yeah. So right I was like, okay. Yeah, right around 100 yeah. So <clears throat> these are the Sunday linen shorts, new with tag. I, I, I'm glad that I found this brand. And now we're going to Brand new going tag on eBay. Too. Crazy. So that I was super excited. I swear I found it. I was like, cool. Oh my gosh. Oh good. You did get it. What a great decision. Yes. I know everybody in the chat was like, yeah, I get it. They're good. And I'm like, okay, I know they're good. I just, the price. Can we see the tag? You want to, um, it's, it's hard to see, the new, the, yeah, the but it says spell, spell and, and the gypsy. gypsy. Um, that's what the tag looks like for all of you on Facebook. Brand new with tags spell and the gypsy. Very short shorts right there. Very, very short. 
They're just Sunday linen shorts. Very like, short. Chill, chill lounge shorts. My daughters have those on. No way. They wouldn't be able to leave the house. Barefoot Dreams size I found this. 2X for 13 bucks. I was looking for Barefoot Dreams. I was on a mission today. Did you get them Lou Joggers? I did. You know, I love me some Barefoot Dreams. Mine is in the wash right now. I can't wait to. Oh my God. They have to fly literally right over our house. Check the, the monitor. Make sure the thing is all the way down. Every freaking night. They I know. Fly right over our house at the same exact time. This is going on what now for a dollar? Whoa. Oh. What is that? Even? That's a that's a that's a barefoot dreams. What robe. is that? I've never seen that one. Barefoot dreams robe. Somebody hit me up about this, so this might actually already be sold. Oh, okay, never Besides mind. Two X. Forgot who did, but I have to check. This you grabbed a girls. Yeah, this is North it's a Face Denali. girls Denali jacket. We paid five bucks. Wow, five bucks. Yeah, that's why I paid paid for it. Five bucks. I, we nice don't really like kids picking up Denali jacket. Kids clothing, but this is an easy sale right here. Easy money. I have not been reading chat, and I'm so sorry. I fail epically. How old are you? Which one? I'm about to turn 31. He's about to turn 31. I am 31. Yeah, she's older. She's a cougar. <laughs> Probably like a couple months older than me. I'm a December baby, okay? Where are my December babies at? Worst worst month to have a birthday. By far. <laughs> yeah. That's Okay. I've got more stuff here at the bottom. That's why I am. See, Kelly's a December baby too. Where's my daughter is the eighth. See, we got a lot of December birthdays. I'm the seventeenth. I'm a week before Christmas Eve. Up oh, and yep, Skittles. Yep. My stepdad, he's a December baby too. <laughs> he knows the struggle. These are size small athletas. We did pay the full ten, but look at the pattern on these. These are really cool. Those are pretty cool. These are nice, and of course they have the pocket on the back. That's why I did grab them. These are for whatnot. Um, yeah, I like the pattern on those. I'm older than my husband, too. See, Trisha? That's cougars. A good thing. What? All you cougars. My mom's birthday was December 17th. See? December's have we're good. We've got good birthdays. You just ignore Facebook. It's okay. I'll, I'll, I'll answer. I'll, I'll answer. Kayla's not as good. She's, she's a rookie when it comes to live, so I'll go back and answer a bunch of questions. <laughs> okay. I know, I know. <laughs> Oh, what did what did she say? Then use your umbilical cord and reattach it every time they need some juice. Yes, they they reattach their cord. I did not charge that. It was yeah. in my bag. I have I mine somewhere charge. around here. I keep forgetting to grab it. These are medium aloes. We did pay fifteen, but these are nice. They're really long. Medium aloes. These are going to end up on whatnot. It does have the logo on here somewhere. Yeah, we got aloes this weekend. We got Lulu's. We got Athleta. We got everything. Ethan's got wife North is Face. older than him, too. See, all the wives all the are older than the men. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Cougar Central. More athletic size small. Hey, thanks, Chris. I have a mustache. <laughs> Ten bucks. Again, nice pattern. That's why. Why are you laughing? I have a mustache. <laughs> Those are going to end up on whatnot as well. <laughs> I'm older than my husband. See? Cougars. I'm December. December. Listen. December. Cougars I can't have to speak stick together. Time. I get it. Whatever. We're just better. How do y'all determine what lists on eBay or whatnot? I think those are mine. We are still trying to figure that out exactly what does better. Yeah, we're still testing what brands on whatnot. So some random brands, like last week I threw up Beyond Yoga, which is a great brand for eBay, um, and it did really well on whatnot as well, so you might start seeing that brand more. I think these are yours. Kind of just testing that, everything. This is, uh, you can show that sweater. Even though I found it, you should show it off. Is this the... Yeah. Everybody told me this was a really, really good sweater. Let's pop quiz everybody. Yeah. Who knows what this is? Who knows? Oh. I didn't even know what it was until I actually passed it, and then everybody told me to go back and grab it. Thanks, chat. I would have never grabbed this item. <laughs> What do you guys think about selling Victoria's Secret clothes? I came across a good deal on 300 items. Um, we pick up the bras, like um, if they're the right price, Victoria's Secret bras. I've never sold anything else Victoria's Secret, though, so I don't know. Lulu Founder brand, yep. Kit and Ace, yep. Kit and Ace. How much did you pay for it? We didn't pay that much for it. It's right there. Um, why did why paid six fifty six fifty for this. It's 100% cashmere um, hoodie. 
looking thing. I don't know what the heck that is. Women, why are your items so weird? Does Look this like go over and then you wear? I don't know. You're asking the wrong guy. <laughs> I'm confused. It looks like a hoodie, but then it looks like the back it's is like open. It's like an open hood? Yeah, but it's 100% cashmere. <laughs> Um, I don't, I looked up comps. The comps are a little bit all over the place. Um, there's not many listed and somebody said they saw it sell for like 165 on Poshmark. So I have to do more research on this, but this is definitely an eBay item and not a whatnot item. Cause I don't know if many people even know that brand. Cause I had no clue what it was. So Kit and Ace, very European. Yeah. Mm. It's a Smurf hoodie. Yeah. What brand is that? Kit and Ace, K-I-T and A-C-E, Kit and Ace. Wayne wears those after you go to sleep, Kayla. Mm -hmm. Just I do. try I on try all these clothes. Of course, I have to see. I have to do product research. So <laughs> I'm definitely wearing that belly one after this live. Oh. All right, six bucks. We found some Alphalete. Um, nice leggings. These are 25 to 30. I'm going to put these on. What? I don't know. Are you going to put them on eBay? I think I might do eBay for these. I don't know. So, what do you guys think? Alphalete. We haven't put that up on whatnot. This is where we're still trying to learn what does. We don't know. I think we should try it. Alphalete's a good brand. I think we should try it. Everybody's saying it's a scarf. Oh, Reisner, the scarf wraps twice. It's not a hood. Oh, it's a scarf. Oh. Yeah. See, guys, we, were, we wear polo shirts. That's about as deep as we get. We wear polo shirts. We don't have these scarf things that go around our heads. Yeah. Everybody says, well, okay, somebody said, what, what not? What not? What not it is. Why am I? Oh, these are aloes. We got some aloes. Where is the size? Oh, man. It's rubbed off. It is. I think these are a medium. I think I meant to put these ones back, and I didn't. These are a size 10. Nice black moto aloes. Um, it's just, like, barely. Like, you can just see where it says aloe, but you can't see the size. This looks like a medium. I'd say a medium. Yeah. I guess we'd have to measure. Yeah. I meant to put those back because the size tag wasn't on there. Okay. For seven fifty, we got some North Face sweats. These are a size medium. Nice, comfy sweats. We got the logo there on the side. Ooh, ooh. Flip the camera, throwing me off. Uh, what not are eBay? Uh, what not? All my stuff is here at the bottom, the very bottom. Did you show the Barefoot Dreams yet? Sorry, just hopped on late. We did. Yeah, we we did. just showed it a little bit ago. I'll grab it. Okay, this is a brand I passed. I cannot say it. Cit cit Citron? I'm sorry if I'm butchering this completely. We paid um, $2.50 or $3 for this. Um, when I looked up the comps, they were over 40, 40-ish and over. Never heard of this brand before. But for three bucks, we're gonna give it a shot. It had a good sell-through rate and a good price. So- Definitely eBay item. I said it right. Okay, good. <laughs> Just like, sure that. did I say that right? Oh, it's the, barefoot. the Barefoot Dreams, size 2X. Just like a, it's almost like a lightweight crew neck, fluffy sweater. Sweater. Oh, it's so soft. Yep. It's a nice one. Very soft. Good pickup. Citron, Citron is like flax, same buyer. Oh, nice. gotcha. That makes sense. It kind of looks like flax. It doesn't kind of. um. That's a pair of genies if you want to show those. I found those on the new rack. Oh, yeah. We got some Gita Blues. My favorite jeans. Capri Fit. We paid $8. Brand new rack. Judy's. Yeah, he went back, you know, to stall with you guys on the phone. Hey, thanks for that. So he can, you know, win the like battle and, and found some Judy's. Sometimes you got to do a little extra, okay? Sometimes you got to work a little harder than others to get the W, Everybody okay? Everybody here And said, that's what happened. I won. I hit the W. We're, oh, we're throwing those on you, there. We're winners. Okay. Yeah. All right. Extra small gym shark. We paid five dollars. These are going up on whatnot. I like to have sizes for everybody, so I did grab these extra smalls. Oh, they do have this cool like pattern here in the front. I don't know if you guys can see that. Gym shark. He's insufferable. Sometimes you're insufferable. Chris, that's too big of a word. What does that even mean? <laughs> insufferable. Does that mean I'm not suffering anymore? What does that mean? I think the rest of my. I think mind. that's the rest for this bag. I think we I still just got, got a little bit more. Three more bags, by the way. Three more bags. Well, and it said I won it, and then when I got off. Listen, you're paying these people to say this. Oh, wow. You're paying them. All right, here's a really good brand to be on the lookout for. I found this one on a new rack, too. The brand is Ibex. I B 
E X. I wish the light would stop. It, it's like a glare. There you go. I B E X. You're looking for that little logo right there. Yeah, let, let Wayne borrow books sometime. That's what you just said. <laughs> Ibex, this is just an Ibex polo, but this thing should sell really, really fast. We only paid $4 for this. Really good brand to be on the lookout for. It's kind of similar to like Icebreaker, um, Arcteryx, like those kind of brands. That's where this one should sell about right at that price. So, hey, yo, Blue Cheese, what's up? Can you do both, both whatnot and eBay at the same time? Uh, we're not going to list an item on eBay and whatnot because if it sells on eBay, then we have to take it down from whatnot. So we just pick a, pick what platform we're going to put it on. Skittle says we're both winners. I like that. We're both winners, but I want a little bit more. Oh, um, this is a <laughs> this is a um, color blocked um, vineyard vines, and this was at the end of one of the racks. It, it was it was not it didn't just come out because it was a different color. It was from last week. So somebody picked this up and decided nah, I don't want that anymore, and they put it um, back on the new rack, and I picked it up. So we put, only paid seven fifty for this. This is definitely going on uh, whatnot. Really cool looking shirt. Always pick up color block shirts. They do really, really well. Oh, this is not. Don't. don't Judy know why Blues I was are accent. a size 31, Nora. Yeah, Judy's are a size 31. But yeah, really nice. Really nice color block shirt. This is going whatnot. Definitely a whatnot item. Ethan, did you open the garage? No, Ethan's not allowed out of the garage. All right, another. Another what? Another. Another um, off the new rack item. These are a pair of cool men's pants. And look at that price. They, they always price cool up in the store, but for some reason, these were only five bucks. I'll take that all day, every day. Um, one of these has a small stain on it. I don't know if it's this pair. No, this pair looks good. No stains on these. This will probably go up on whatnot. Um, the one with the stain, I'll probably list on eBay. But those look to be in really good condition. Cool is a really good brand to be on the lookout for. Next up. Another pair of cools, size 34. Again, right off a new rack. We paid $6 for these. Love finding cool. Can't believe they were on a new rack for six bucks. But this, I think these have a stain on them. One of them has something. Yeah, right there. See? It's... See at the bottom? There's like a stain right there. I think it'll come out. We'll just have to wash these. But either way, even if they have stains in them for six bucks, I think I can still sell these for 35 with stains on them. So, boom. That one's done. All right, let's see what else we got. We got three more bags to go through, people. That's what you have when you get a $1,000 haul. You get all this stuff. I'm going to try to blast through some of these. Boy Scouts of America, we paid $2 for this. This should go for $25. It's a kid's Boy Scout of America, so maybe like $20 on this. But two and a 20, I'll take that all day, every day. The Vineyard That's, was a large. The Vineyard Vines is a large. That is definitely an eBay item. That is not going to go on what, whatnot. I think that might sell for like 2 bucks on whatnot. Again, I'm going to blast through these. This is a $4 Polo Ralph Lauren. We're going to list this for $17.99 plus ship. That's an eBay item. Ooh, Sarah. Not a fan was the only reason why I stayed. What? In my experience, Ibex sells for the most and has the best sell rate of all the Murano. Yeah, 100%. I agree. I, that's actually the first time I found it, but I know how well those sell. They sell really fast, really well. Um, Lacoste, four bucks. Lacoste, I'm going to do $17.99 plus ship on this, and that's going to be a surf up method item on that one. I went to a GS last weekend, and this lady had like 20 pair of new attack Judy Blue jeans for $10 each. I bought all the other larger sizes. She had left smaller sizes since I was unsure. That's still a good pickup for $10 each for Judy Blue's brand new attack. That's not bad at all. Where'd you go with GS? What is a GS? What is GS? Mm -hmm. Um, this is a foot joy. It's a size small foot joy. We only paid three bucks for it. This will probably go up on whatnot because this one doesn't have any club embroidery anywhere on it. So I think this will be a good uh, whatnot piece. Oh, garage sale. Got you. Garage sale. I thought it was like a store. Appreciate the resub, Kathy. Thank you so much for the resub over on TikTok. Another Polo Ralph Lauren, $4 Polo. What is this for? Yeah, $4 Polo Ralph Lauren again, $17.99 plus ship. My bad. I should have known that garage sale. I don't go to any of those things. I don't even know what they are. Go to one of those like once a year. Uh, another marmot. We paid $5 for this marmot. Just a short sleeve marmot shirt. Again, this is going to go up on whatnot. Easy whatnot piece. Uh, K-Way is not with us on the garage sale. Yeah, I don't go to garage sales. I just don't. Because we get all this stuff. So why should I go to garage sale? Polo Ralph Lauren, again, 4 bucks for this one. List it for $17.99 plus ship plus ship 
another one. This is another pole Ralph Lauren. This is a 2XL, just a simple 2XL. We paid $4 for this one. Again, this one will probably be like $14.99 plus ship. Why $17.99 plus ship? That is the um, that is the surf's up method. I was about to say the, that's the K-Way method. No, that's the surf's up method. Um, you find something that you normally pass on. Like normally I'd pass. <laughs> what was that? You sent it to me and I missed it. It was an angry <laughs> like levity. Yeah, as a as a new as a new gift, and I haven't seen it before. So I said it and then I freaking oh. missed it. But um $17.99 plus ship is a surf's up method. You pick up something that you normally pass on for five dollars and under, list it for $17.99 plus ship. Uh, mainstream brands like Polo, Ralph Lauren, like Lacoste, some Brooks Brothers he's been picking up and he's been listing for $17.99 plus ship and making your $10 profit and getting out pretty quick. This is a nice, easy $17.99 or $19.99 plus ship item. Big Pony logo. Yeah, I didn't see it. Dang it. I can't believe I missed the lemonade, buddy. It was an angry lemonade. Where is it again? Where is it again? Hold on. I've never seen that before. There it is right there. Where? Oh, there it is. Okay, we're going to set it again. Maybe somebody else will give it to me and I won't miss it. <laughs> Lemonade, buddy. I wish I had red, white, and blue near me. The nearest is an hour and a half away. It might be worth it to venture an hour and a half to go find it. So ungrateful. Dang, kids. I, I'm not ungrateful. I just missed it. 2XL, um, uh, short sleeve, North Face, really good size, really good brand. Uh, we only paid $7.50 for this. This will be a whatnot item. I do surf's up method with Nike golf. Yes. Nike golf and under armor too, are two brands that he also does the surf's up method on. So yeah. All right. Here's a cool find. I wasn't going to oh, pick. Look, look. Okay. I look, I found it. <laughs> I saw it. I saw it this time. The angry lemonade. Thank what? you. Ethan. What? There's another one. There's two, angry there's two angry lemonades. lemonades. Those are very angry lemonades. Why are they so angry? It says lemonade buddy. Why is the buddy angry? <laughs> Weird. There's another one. He gets Everybody's mad when you drink it. You get you get mad when you drink. Okay, that's enough. That's enough lemonade. Not no more lemonade. <laughs> uh, this is a starter. It's brand new with tags. It's an older starter from the world. It's a 1997 World Series brand new with tag. Pretty cool find. I was gonna pass on this, but then I saw the tags and I was like, wait, that's probably gonna be worth picking up because um, you don't find many of these dead stock anymore, especially from the World Series from uh, 19. 97 1997 so this will probably go on whatnot i think this will be a cool like random whatnot piece to run brand new with tag so i'll throw it i'll throw it up on whatnot i'll throw it up on whatnot might as well appreciate all the um lemonades you guys just sent me you guys didn't have to go crazy with the lemonade you go insane okay here's a here's a brand i looked up comps comps are all over the place but i'm gonna list this really high Why, oh we were still running the caption over here. whoops Sorry. Sorry, uh, YouTube and Facebook. We're just like bombarding you with the birthday whatnot show over here. I completely didn't mean to do that. Um, the brand is Kohana Moko. Kohana Moko. Kahana. Kahana Moko. Here's the tag for all you beautiful people out there. Kahana Moko. It says Kahana. Can't really read it. Kahana Moko. And it says Duke Champion. I look these up. Um, this is a rayon cotton blend one. This is definitely an eBay item. Um, there was some that have sold for around $100. Uh, one sold for $120. That kind of looks similar to this one. So I'm going to list this thing massively high. The reason I looked it up is because even red, white, and blue priced it at its half off. So it's $15. So knowing them, if they've done a little bit of research on this, it's probably worth me doing a little bit of research. So we'll see. I'll let you guys know what that sells for. But I've never found that brand before. But the comps look pretty good. I sold one for 70 bucks. That's what Flippin' Nurse says. So if I sell that for 70 I paid 15 for it. After fees, shipping, cost of goods, that's like $35 to $40 profit. So I'll take that all day. Next up, we got a Polo Ralph Lauren. Just a simple one. Polo Ralph Lauren. And we paid $4 for this one. Again, $17.99 plus ship. We got a Lacoste. Newer label Lacoste. We paid $5 for this one. It has a pretty cool gator on the front. A little bit of a bigger gator. I'm probably going to do $17.99 plus ship on that one. What was the brand? It was called, I can't really pronounce it. It's a, it's a Hawaiian brand, that's for sure. But there is the tag. I'll show YouTube and Facebook in a second. That's what the tag looks like, made in the USA. That's the tag. I've never seen that tag before, but I did look it up. It looks pretty good. Looks like, well, Flippin' Nurse said she sold one for $70. So I'm going to list for probably like right around there. Got a little untuck it size medium short sleeve. This one was only four bucks. They were pricing untuck it up at that store, like 
a month ago, if you guys remember, they were pricing Untucket up at 20 bucks a piece. Nobody bought it. Nobody bought these for 20 bucks. So what they had to do was they had to drop the price. So they even put it for eight bucks and it sat for a whole week and I bought it for four. So that's the cycle of this store. They're going to have items for crazy prices. You just have to deal with it. When they don't sell, they will eventually drop the price. Same with the um, Etten shirts. They recently, they had those for like 60 and now they're down to like $15 half off. And then same with the Zegna shirts. You guys remember they had like 15 Zegna shirts all for a hundred bucks each. They're still pretty much all there. They're now 25 half off and they're still sitting there. So do you pick up all Polo Ralph Lauren? Not all of it, but when I find Polo Ralph Lauren brand new at tags for 10 bucks, I can't pass that up. It's a size medium, I believe. Yeah, size medium, brand new at tags. That'll be up on whatnot. Untucket is $100 new. Exactly. Yes, it is. Brand new, it's 100 bucks. Uh, used, that should go for somewhere around like, um, probably like 30-ish, 25 to 30-ish for a short sleeve. So, yeah. Next up, um, another Polo Ralph Lauren, just a simple bread and butter Polo Ralph Lauren. It's a black striped. Again, $17.99 plus ship is what I'm going to list that for. On four eating shirts and the flea for $2. Let's go. That's an awesome scoop right there. Another one, Polo Ralph Lauren. This one was $4 as well. Some of these are a little bit lower. That's why I keep looking at the price. Sold an Affliction t-shirt today for $40. Well, speaking of Affliction, I have one in here somewhere. We just got to find it. Here we go. We got a 2XLT Polo Ralph Lauren. Really good size. It does have a small hit on the front. It says Ralph Lauren. Oh, is it stained underneath the armpits? It is. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. The it other needs side to be washed. Too. This needs to be washed. It's got some big boy stains on there. We'll throw some Bell's Nafta underneath there and hopefully get those stains out. If not, I'll still list that. It'll still sell. I'll just have to disclose that it has stains. I'll list it for like $10 plus ship. Make my money back and get out. Get in, get out. Next up, we have another Polo. This one, four bucks. You already know where I'm going to list that one at. Um, another brand new tag Polo. This one is $12.50. Again, this is a whatnot piece, and it is a size medium. Dawn Power Wash is mating stain. Really, yeah, we'll use the Fells Nafta on that. It should get the stains pretty much out. So Fells Nafta is what we use. It's like a bar. It looks like a bar of soap. Okay, so I did pick this one up. This is a Robert Graham. It is a size 2XL. We did pay up for it. We paid 30 bucks, but I think this will do pretty good on whatnot because it's a really cool pattern. It's got like a weird, like geometric pattern going all throughout and then look at that flip cuff it's a beautiful flip cuff nice abstract flip cuff along with that abstract pattern so that'll be up on whatnot starting at a dollar good size too um, in that size 2xl so i think this will do pretty good um can you make a tiktok video on how you take pictures of clothes i can't but what you can do is you can come back to my live tomorrow night at not yeah 9 30 p.m eastern standard time i'm going to be taking photos tomorrow on live so you can see the whole process live in action. I also have YouTube and Facebook lives posted right now of me doing some listings as well. So you can go watch those at any time. You can see exactly how I do it. But yeah, the, 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 the videos don't make much sense because I do it so often on live. So how much would those usually sell for? So that one, if I listed it on eBay, I'd list it for at least minimum of $69.99 plus ship. It's got a good pattern. It's a good size. So I think Easily, you could get $69.99 plus ship on that one. It's an easy, easy, probably even more. I'd probably list it higher than that, actually, because it's a good size. All right, we got some Carhartt Force, five bucks. I think these are a good size, too. Uh, size 42, really good size cargo shorts. These will go up on whatnot, starting at a dollar. Have you ever picked up? Have you ever picked up what? The brand Kitspo? I haven't. I've never picked up Kitspo before. Um, Roar, kind of like Affliction. This is an older tag, but these still do pretty well. Size medium. The thing you're looking for with these, I've only paid five bucks, is the heavy, heavy embroidery. So we have some embroidery on the front, and then look at that back embroidery. Look at that back hit. Really, really nice back hit on this one. Um, we paid five bucks for it. This is going to actually go on whatnot. I'm curious on how well this does on whatnot. I don't find Roar too often. Um, normally I list these pretty high and I wait for the right buyer. I'll list these for like around 40 bucks on eBay. I think it'll probably do around that, maybe 30 on whatnot. So we'll throw that up this weekend, see how well it does. Um, do your iron clothing, the only time that we, um, washers, the only time we wash items, if they have stains or bad smells, we don't do any ironing. I don't even know how to iron. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I know so how bad. to iron, but I just don't I want to. I have no idea how to do that. 
We did pay full price for this, $10. These are J Crew, but these are J Crew with the Kaihara denim. I sold a pair like a week ago for 40 bucks. So that's why I picked these up really nice. And they also have the Kaihara denim little tag in the back back there too. So really nice pair of uh, jeans. Sold a roar that looks like that. Like Robin Hood tunic for 98 in a day. Holy cow. What's up, Indiana? Appreciate you hopping in. So much domestic goodness. So much domestic goodness. Um, this is Goddess. a woman's goddess. You can't read. Oh, I messed that up. <laughs> My bad. Um, I think the rest of these are women's. That's. Did I find it? <laughs> I don't remember finding it. Okay. I'm pretty sure you found this. Maybe I did. More Athleta. This is the older tag, but it is a size large. Maybe I did find this. I don't remember. But this is a nice. No, nope, you found it. Yeah. Nice jacket. Nice full zip. Good size. Quilted in the front, like a nice, like cotton on the side. Mm -hmm. Really nice jacket. That'll go on eBay later. Super nice. That was it for me. Really? Yep. Oh. Oh wait, no, no, no. I yeah. found some more stuff. Hold on, hold on, guys. I'm struggling right now. Okay. Eileen Fisher. This is a size extra large. This is a. We paid seven fifty, and this is a hundred percent wool cardigan. Nice red cardigan. I like picking up Eileen, especially when the material is nice. Card her cardigans do very well. Like this is thirty five and up, depending on the material and all that. You're into winter, or you want to do now? I'm gonna list that now. eBay now. Cardigans I'll list all year. We can do all year. I think that. Oh wait, there's more. But wait. But wait, there's more. There's more. Lily Plitzer. These are a size six. Nice, cute pattern. We did pay $10. These are going on whatnot. Very cute. Nice pink Lily shorts. Lily. Lily. Oh, I'm in love with this dress, guys. This is for whatnot, but it's so stinking cute. This is a medium free people. We did pay $12. I've seen this dress like two weeks ago and I left it behind. But look how pretty. It's got shimmery it's stuff all shiny. through it. It's shiny. It's a cute, shiny, like mini dress. So I was like, ooh, this is for my now. Very cute. Can we do the stuff on? Oh, you got it. Yeah, there's some more stuff here at the bottom. This is an older free people, but I really like the top. This is a size six. I'm assuming, I'm pretty sure that's older. Free people. Just a nice blouse. It's like beads. Looks like a, like a, what do they call it? Like boho? Boho, yeah. Like a boho blouse. I don't know blouse. what the fuck that means. I don't, even really, I don't know why that was even in my vocabulary. <laughs> yeah, I'm really impressed that you knew that. I was drawing a complete blank until you said it. Did you do your vic victory lap? I'm tired. Um, I couldn't because he cheated. I did my victory lap, though. He's a cheater. Big W. Mm -hmm. All right. Spanx, of course, size medium. We did pay 10 bucks. We've sold these faux leathers for 35 before, so I had no problem grabbing them for 10. For you. <laughs> then I picked up for 750 this Mave extra small, nice long sleeve blouse. For whatnot. What not? What's not? He likes boho. He He's going to wear it while Kayla is sleeping. All these oh, yeah, clothes. I'm going to try that on for sure. He's going to try this whole, yeah, right. whole haul on. That would rip in half. Athleta, size small. It was five bucks. This is for whatnot. Nice workout tank top, lightweight stretch tank top. Yep. Um, I'll do the stuff on top if you want me to. Well, it's your men's stuff. Okay. So, shout out to Jenny. Who saw this Jenny from the block purse that I walked right by and she's like, Hey, go get that long champ purse, which I've never heard of the brand before, I guess. So there's a button in the back. You can like roll this up. Never heard of this brand. It was $8. I showed her everything on the inside and it is legit. And she said it can sell for around 40. So I didn't even look up comps. I just trusted her. I was like, man, she's, I don't, eagle eye. I don't know how she saw this. So we're going to give it a try. Um, 
there's a little little hardware she's saying look at all the pieces here and the buttons you can even see the horse here so we're gonna give it go for that one give it a shot do that for ebay i think i'm gonna put it on ebay because i yeah. want to see even though it's used she said it'll be fine so i love long champ see i've never heard of this before so this was new to learn today when we were going through the purses yes i have a blue one great fine yeah no that i walked right by it if it was not for the chat i would have just kept on going we were learning purses today trying to figure out how to tell if they're real shout out to you guys Passing to you. That's the last bag right there. Oh, okay. I have four of them. Oh, so I guess it's a popular bag that I just walked by. I'm not going to um, walk by them anymore. Uh, Laura asked, how much do you sell the Ralph Lauren polos new with tags? They should at least go for 35 probably 40 on eBay, because right now, TJ Maxx, you can't pay less than 50 for them. New here, just dropping by. Love the reseller community. I don't sell much women's clothing, but I love simple men's shirts. Awesome. Appreciate you stopping by. J-Ride. How much do you want for the long champ? Uh, you, right. you want to look Just it up look real it quick? Up. Yeah. Hit us up on um, uh, Lore. If you have a um, IG, hit me up on IG, Kway Shop, and we'll give you a price after the live because she's got to look it up. She doesn't even know what to price it at. Next up, we got a Marmot. Um, this is a Windbreaker, seven fifty for the Marmot Windbreaker. Really nice. Um, just a nice, simple, longer Marmot Windbreaker. This will go on eBay or whatnot later on in the year. So, all right, switching from free ship to plus ship. On some items, we do do plus ship. It's not all free shipping anymore in my store. If you go check my store right now, I think 200 of my listings are um, plus shipping. We got an Everlane. This is an this is a me find. We paid seven. No, this might be you find. 750 for an Everlane pullover turtleneck. This will be listed um, come winter season. Next up, we got a foot joy. There were some foot joys that were priced really high there, and there's other ones that were priced low. I don't know why some were priced different differently but there's a foot joy dry joys we only paid three bucks for this thing um it does have a golf club embroidery on the front but um it'll still do good it's one of the um, short sleeve windbreakers it does have a big foot joy on the back too so these sell all year round because golfers go out early morning they go play golf when it's cold so they want something a little bit you know heavier on them like a windbreaker and then they take them off halfway through their golfing trip wow, so they do they do be good. These are like 40, 50. Wow. This is a Kayla find. Made well. Linen shorts. Uh, linen shorts, 650. These are going to go on whatnot. They are a size medium. Oh, it's going to fall. It's going to fall. And then last item for this bag. And then we just got one more bag and then we're done. I won't keep you guys too much longer. Size 38. These are men's Patagucci's. Uh, we paid 750 for these. Just a nice pair of Patagucci shorts. And these will go up on whatnot. For a doll hair, take that one from me. And then we got and these bags are attacking my leg. Um, what about Madewell jeans? We don't really pick up Madewell jeans too much unless they're super, super cheap. They have to be super cheap. What is whatnot? Link tree link in my bio. Sign up this weekend. We have a whatnot show. Here we go. Ready for this? Even though I kept it on for a while for you guys, we have a whatnot show this weekend. We're going to run a hundred items at one dollar. It's my birthday show. My birthday's on Sunday. Um, and we're also going to have all of our new merch shirts available this weekend. So come out to our whatnot show, go bookmark it. It's live right now. You can literally leave, go bookmark the show. Um, it should be fun. And we're going to give away a pair of 350 Yeezys. I'll show you guys that at the end of this live brand new inbox, 350 Yeezy size 10 and a half Onyx brand new inbox buyer appreciation. So if you buy something, you'll be entered in the giveaway. Do you want to try? try oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. So this is not going anywhere because Miss Kayla found herself a brand new purse. It's a Kate Spade bag. I paid $10 for my Kate Spade bag. I'm going to keep it for myself and then we can sell it later. That's what she says to me. We can sell it later. Yeah. So this is, this is a Kayla. This, don't even look at this. It's just going here. Figure out what you're going to do with that thing. <laughs> it's, a, it's a Kayla find. It's going yeah, right to the personal it. closet. I'm going to use it. I trust me. I have like 65 bags in the closet. Well, I can get rid of the coach one now. You see how that works? Oh, I see how that works. You want to run that on whatnot? I don't know because I don't know if it's real. Oh, okay. I don't yeah, want to yeah. We can ask somebody if they fake. can look at it. Here's a really cool Brooks Brothers. It's a leather Brooks Brothers. So this is really cool because it has a zip off liner. You can see right there. The liner is wool. The outer is leather. 
and we only paid seven fifty for this. It's a really good Brooks Brothers jacket. This is definitely a winter listed item. It's a nice leather full j zip jacket, and this has got to be like, I want to say this is like um, some special kind of leather. Hold on, Let's see if I can find it. Just says genuine genuine leather, but it's a really soft leather, really soft. So that's really good find. Seven fifty for that. That's like easy money, easy money. Sir, you kept all those Lulu shorts last week. Damn it! Stop calling me out. Yeah. Why is yeah, everybody so I get my little team? ten dollar purse, okay? And it's legit. I'm, I'm wearing sure. them. Actually, no, I'm not everybody wearing them. Everybody right said now. we think it's real. This is seven fifty. These are men's um, vineyard vines swim trunks. I want to try these on eBay to see how well these do. Because if they do good, then I'm gonna start picking these up. Um, the last pair I picked up had a hole in the back, so I couldn't even list them. So, yeah, too bad. Too bad. So sad. All right, we're almost done, people. This is a Kayla. This is a Kayla. Oh, I think you found some of Oh, Nike shorts. We paid $4 for these. I'm going to do the surf's up method on these. List these for $17.99 plus ship. Surf's up. I'm going to surf on those. Um, here's a Pendleton. This will be on whatnot, starting at a dollar. Um, we paid $12.50 for this. It's a Pendleton deck shirt. Always just look up the brand or the, the style. It's right there at the top. Pendleton deck shirt, size large. Nice double breast pocket. Um, just a nice shirt. Nice shirt. It's got like this nice liner on the inside too. So that'll be up on whatnot for dull hair. Got to roll. See a piece out. We're almost done peeps. This will be up on whatnot for a dollar. This is a men's Patagucci size two XL. Really good size on this. There was actually another thrifter that went through the aisle and he missed this. I don't know why he didn't pick it up, but, uh, this will sell really well on whatnot. This will be up for a dollar going this weekend. Patagucci size two XL. Be there, whatnot, this weekend. This is a North Face. This was actually from our Salvation Army haul that it fell in this bag. We got this for free. If you go check me out on threads, you'll understand how I got this for free. So you should go follow me on threads right now, and it'll tell you exactly how we got this for free. Um, go follow me on threads. You want to say that again? Hey, can you go follow me on threads? It'll tell you how I got that for free. Uh, we paid $5. These are really good. These are Polo Ralph Lauren, but they're patchwork shorts. Um, these are definitely like an eBay item. They got button fly too. I didn't realize that. They're a whole button fly. That's really cool. Old school Paul Ralph Lauren patchwork. Really good. Um, I'm going to look those up. Those might be worth a pretty penny. Um, do, 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 do. Trying to get through this quick because we've been live for almost an hour and a half now. It's another um, Foot Joy size, size large, $5 Foot Joy windbreaker. We might run this on whatnot. This is a really nice windbreaker. Probably run that on whatnot this weekend. Patagucci cheese ball. It is Patagucci. If you go, if you go listen, um, you go on YouTube right now and type in Patagucci. There's literally a song called Patagucci. What's up, Liv? Uh, another pair of Carhartts. We have lots of Carhartt to run this weekend. By the way, we have new with Tag Carhartt to Car jeans. Six fifty Carhartt shorts. Um, These will do good on whatnot. We'll throw those up on whatnot. Weird. Colors sell. So this is an older label, Polo Ralph Lauren, size medium. But look at that color. Look how crazy that shirt is. This shirt will sell really well. Probably list this for like $24.99 plus ship just based off that crazy color. Really nice. Don't be afraid to pick up um, items that look like that. The crazier, normally the better that they'll sell. 90s vibes. Is that vintage? It probably is. Based off that label, it probably is vintage. It's hard to date Polo Ralph Lauren, but that is most likely a vintage piece. Psycho Bunny, good brand to be on the lookout for. We did pay 15 for this, but this should sell really well on eBay. We're probably like right around 40 bucks, and it should sell pretty quick. That's the whole reason I paid up for those. Let me see if I can find any other men's. Oh, Affliction. Somebody mentioned it earlier. I found an Affliction piece. It has a Marshalls tag on it. I didn't realize that they sold Affliction at Marshalls back in the day. This is an older Marshalls tag. Definitely an older one. But uh, I guess you can consider this like new other because it hasn't clearly been worn. Um, and it's been sitting in somebody's closet. But we paid $7.50 for this. This is going up on whatnot. Look at that back hit. Look how crazy that back hit is. That's in freaking sane. Um, has the front hit as well. But that back hit is what's going to make this thing sell. Um, older, older. Uh, piece right there. That's a whatnot. Oh. Yeah, that's a whatnot. Um, who is it? 
Um, aging with styles. Aging with styles. I think you said your husband's looking for a solid white. I don't know if you're here. I'll DM you. But if you're here, your husband was looking for a solid white Columbia, right? In size XL. I think this is what you were looking for. Let me know. If not, we'll sell this. But we picked this up because I think this is what you were looking for. If so, we can meet up with you. You can just pay us what we paid for. That's completely fine. But I think that's what you're looking for. She asked us at a thrift store the other day, if you ever see a solid white Columbia shirt, um, put it to the side and she'll buy it from us because she can't find any. The rest is all you. So if you're in the chat, just let me know. If not, I'll DM you on the side. Okay. I'm going to go through these fast because I'm exhausted right now. Um, North Face leggings. These are a size large. We paid $5. Nice the, Capri North Face leggings. What the hell does that even mean? Bro, you can sell images on eBay way easier. I have no clue what that means, Mr. Steve. I like your name, though, because that's my middle name, but I have no clue what you're saying. What is this? What not? Yeah. Um, these are for what not, because I already know. These are a size six. These are Lululemon. Look how pretty. I love these. I love the color. I love the pattern on these. What not only. Don't DM me right now. This is going on what not. What Specific not. for what not. Specifically, there's your nice shiny logo right there. Uh, we did pay 15 These will be a dollar on Saturday for what not. These are a size six. Size six. What not only. Don't DM me. What not only. What not only. I'm not giving those ones up to Saturday. These are another pair of size small Athletas. Five or ten bucks, but I picked them up because of the pattern crazy pattern very nice so these are for whatnot as well and that's that's it Whew. that's it that's a thousand dollar thrift store haul that's our biggest thrift store haul yet and we really got a ton of stuff like those polo ralph lauren shirts our average buy cost you don't have the other receipt it's in my purse oh it's in your purse uh well, i'll check up the average buy cost i'll put it on my threads Tonight, I'll write on my threads exactly what our average buy cost was, but it has to be pretty low because all of our Polo Ralph Lauren was four bucks. We didn't really have, we had a couple Lululemons that we paid up for, that that um, Hawaiian shirt we paid up for, the Robert Graham, but the rest was pretty much like right around the $10 mark. And then that's Polo Ralph Lauren will bring it down. So how many items? I don't know. She has the receipt. We had to break this up into two transactions because I had to call my bank and see if they could extend my limit. Where's the other receipt you put up here? I'll yeah. find it. Oh, it's right here probably. Yeah. There it is right there. So this receipt this receipt has nine items. And then the other receipt is the one that we have the all the other items on. We spent nine twenty on the first transaction. No, nine forty. Nine forty on the first transaction. And then we spent fifty six eighty eight on the second transaction. So yeah, we spent a lot, but that's okay. Answer Most quick, of this was for what not. Lolo's question. Um, is it better to price items at whole numbers? Uh, no, we price everything at ninety nine. It's a it's a common like retail trick. It makes people think that they're getting a deal. If you price it at $19.99, it's pretty much 20, but people think they're in the $10 range when you do $19.99. So that's what we do. Some people do 97, 96, 98. We do 99s. So, but by the way, what not show this weekend, we're giving away a pair of 350 Yeezys as buyer appreciation. Let me grab them really quick so I can show you guys. Buyer appreciation is going to be these Yeezys, Yeezy boosts, size 10 and a half. If you buy one item, including merch, it gets you into the giveaway. Let me open them up really quick. Brand new in the box. These are actually going to be mine. And then now we're giving away because I have two pairs of these. So I can keep one for myself. And then the other one we're going to give away. Easy boost, 350s. These are going to be given away this weekend. Buyer appreciation on whatnot. Go bookmark the show. We have like 200 people in here right now. Everybody should go bookmark the show. I want to see at least 200 bookmarks by the time we run the show. But those are going to be buyer appreciation. You buy one item, you get in. We're going to have low dollar items. We'll have high dollar items. So and if you don't want to buy anything, you just want to hang out and chat, hang out for my birthday, hang out for my birthday this weekend. Um, it'll be 8.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And, yep, new shirts will be available this weekend. We're going to have 100 merch shirts. Well, minus two for us and three we got – or four we got to send to people that we owe merch shirts to. So minus six. Mm -hmm. So we'll have – 94 merch shirts available this weekend. So we'll be really awesome. Hope to see everybody there. How do you pay on whatnot? You set up your, when you log, when first off, you're going to sign up through my link in my bio. So you get $15 credit for free. And then when you sign up, sign up, you're going to put your debit or credit card, or I think they take PayPal, any major credit card company they take. And what you do is you swipe at the bottom. If you win the auction, it charges your card. That's how easy it is. Um, once you get over a pound shipping, 
um, from one pound to five pounds, you get free shipping. So you pay like eight something until you hit that five pound mark, you get free shipping. So the more items you buy, the less chance you give for other people to get in the uh, giveaway. So buy multiple items. So, and then, yeah, Ethan will be here this weekend too. He'll be helping us out because I'm sure it'll be a crazy show. So do you do this for a living, Angela? Yes, we do do this for a living. We don't have another job. We just do this. We do this. We act like we make money, but really we don't. We live off the government. No, I'm just kidding. We make money doing this. Yes. I had somebody on Facebook said, you don't make money doing this. You definitely live off the government. I said, you're right. I live off the government. I actually used to work for the government and I quit my job to do this. So I don't work off the government. I don't live off the government anymore. Shout out to that person on Facebook who doesn't know what they're talking about. Anyways, appreciate you guys hanging out. We're going to head out. We're, we got to eat dinner. I'm freaking starving. I haven't I'm eaten tired. dinner yet. She's tired. I'm hungry. I'm um, if you guys DM me about anything you wanted during the show, I'll check my DMs after I eat. And then uh, I'll be live tomorrow morning shipping out. We have some really good eBay sales to ship out tomorrow. So see you guys tomorrow right around 1030. No, 830 because we're going sourcing again tomorrow. So I'll see you guys 830 in the morning for a shipping live. And then I'll see you guys tomorrow night. So. Do you see the fly that out? keeps flying yeah, it's, a fly it's driving me crazy. Yeah, <laughs> That's why the, I keep looking all over the it's place. It's in the corner of the room right now. Oh. Appreciate you guys hanging out, and I'll catch you on the next one. Bye. Peace.